SOLIDWORKS simulation meshes come in three types, solid, shell, and beam. Each mesh type has a specific use and we will explore these in detail. Solid mesh elements are tetrahedral in shape and have 10 nodes for high quality and 4 nodes for draft quality. Solid elements are best used with bulky geometry, geometry that has similar length, width, and height. Think of a block of a casting or a machine part. The solid element is represented by a block in the simulation tree. A shell mesh element is triangle in shape with no thickness. High quality shell elements have 6 nodes and draft quality shell elements have 3 nodes. The thickness to the elements is assigned by the user and considered virtual. Shell elements are best used for thin geometry, geometry that has large length and width in comparison to its thickness, used for sheet metal, composites, and any other thin parts. A user can create a shell mesh three different ways. Creating a mid-surface in the model, defining the shell by selecting a face of the geometry, or by analyzing sheet metal In the simulation feature tree, a shell is represented by a surface icon and created with a mid-surface or defined by selected faces, a bent icon when sheet metal is being meshed. Beam elements are specific to weldment features, parts that have constant cross-section like an I-beam or two-beam. Beam meshes place nodes along the neutral axis of the beam and are represented by the profile of the part or cylinders. Beams are held together using joints, indicators of nodes that connect the beam elements to one another. Beam meshes provide beam specific results, including shear stress, axial stress, and bending. A beam mesh is indicated by an I beam icon in the simulation tree. Solid shell and beam mesh types round out SOLIDWORKS simulation's various mesh capabilities. The user can use any one of these three mesh types independently or in conjunction with each other in a mixed mesh. In the next video in the series, we will learn how to combine all three mesh elements together in a mixed mesh.